on this draft, we have a, a class of so many good receivers, guys that can do a lot. What, what do you think that is like the most important thing that you can bring to the table for make the teams look at for you? Um, I feel like uh, for me, from my, you know, perspective, you know, coming from the offense, I had to learn things uh, different from other receivers who probably get the ball, you know, seven to ten times a game. Uh, it forced me to know the defense more, uh, be more physical in the run game, um, knowing the alignment assignments, you know, quarterback reads. So uh, I feel like the best receivers in the league come from a running base offense first. And then uh, then my opportunities, you know, I don't get that many opportunities. So uh, when it when it do come, I make a count. So I feel like that's what makes me different from the other receivers in this draft. For the offensive line, when you don't have so many numbers for show, only allowed one sack in 2019 is a good a good part of your tape for the teams. And how, what do you think you can be better for the next level? Um, I think there's something you can always improve on every single day. Um, and technique and offensive line, it's a lot of it's a lot about consistency. Um, sometimes it's doing that mundane work, the work on your angles, working on you know setting to your spot. Um, the sack I had it was all about setting to my spot and, you know, um, not doing what I usually do consistently. And so when mastering that, you know, doing those drills consistently is what I'm going to be doing now, uh, now that pro day is over, to really get better. Uh, you're coming from a program that run force and maybe their running backs doesn't have so many receptions. Uh, how do you think you can work on that for be that, for be that running back who can maybe a light on the slot or can be uses, use it like a, a running back can, who can catch the ball? Yeah, I just, I, I, I always uh, could do that. It just was, I, have, I wasn't given the opportunity, you know. You know, if you have a good uh, offensive line, a dominant offensive line and, and a running back that's getting eight yards a pop, uh, you're not going to, you're not going to, you're not going to fix it. You're going to stick with what's, what's working. And, you know, I don't blame nobody. You know, we were winning. You know, we were dominating teams with our run game. But I, I could always uh, do, you know, run routes, catch. You know, in high school, I was an athlete. I played corner. I played slot. I played safety. I played everything. So I feel like that that uh, helped me, you know, uh, I had advantage. And I feel like, you know, a lot of teams were surprised today because I showed I could catch and run routes. So uh, just keep really working, you know, on, on my skills, you know, keep crafting, you know, running routes and, and just things like that because I can do those things.